All right, so now we're gonna take a look at uh, the iPad App Store, brand new, just launched yesterday, actually, April 2nd, and uh, we're gonna just take a look. Well, one thing I wanna show you guys, we're at the home screen, right? So when you rotate it, take a look at that, the home screen rotates in all directions. That's really cool, but it also happens with the really slick rotation animation. Uh, nice and quick, very responsive, thanks in part to the uh, A4 one gigahertz processor in here and all the graphics technology bit built in. But anyway, what we're going to look at is the App Store. So just go into the home screen, you tap App Store, and you're taken right to a very familiar familiar layout. Um, if you've seen it on the iPhone, you've seen it on your desktop in iTunes, very similar. You, you're given the cover flow, the featured apps up here, the spotlighted apps, you can just kind of pan across and slick uh, slide your finger for sl uh, slide gestures and um, we're going down a little further you have new and noteworthy if you've already installed the app you get the little uh, uh, little badge right here that says installed so you know not to install it again makes sense right well if you come across something that you want to install say kayak flight and that guy is free just tap the tap the app and you're taken to a full overview of the app it looks a lot like the iTunes store on your desktop you've got your reviews your ratings You've got um, you know screenshots. This one's only got one, but um, from here you tap the free button. It'll change to install app. You tap that, and it'll kick you right out, and you'll start installing your application. It'll download, install, and do everything for you. While that's going on, though, you can actually go back into the app store. So that is a little bit of multitasking. So there is no real third-party multitasking, but your native apps will multitask in the iPad. So that's cool. While it's installing back there, take a look. We can scroll down. We can take a look at staff favorites. And we have some quick links here, App of the Week, stuff like iWork that Apple wants to, to promote, um, and all, this, all these panes here, you can kind of just go through and try to discover apps. And this is all in the new apps category. If I hit what's hot, everything reorganizes, and it'll show me what's hot right now. And uh, it'll probably get better with time because the iPad just launched, but you, know, you have all your, your, your spotlight apps here, your what's hot apps here, your featured and new uh, featured apps here and the newsstand here. So you have news apps, basically reader apps, everything that you're going to want for uh, for reading on your on your on your iPad. Um, and right here, you'll notice it integrates with your iTunes account, of course. So if you do have credit on your iTunes account, you can use that to buy apps for your iPad. So um, yeah, quick little look at the App Store for your iPad, and uh, we'll bring you more. Stay tuned.